Hey there, what is going on? This is Rob from Panther Vision. Today I'm going to show you how to stretch text. But before we do that, if you're new on the channel, don't forget to subscribe and hit the notification bell so you get notified with daily updates. All right, so first uh, we're going to type in something. Here is the type tool and click on the screen. Uh, here you can select the font you want. I'm on Drock Wide Web. So as you can see, the text disappeared because I'm on caps lock. So if you're doing like, uh, if you're typing uppercase letters, then, uh, you know, this is going to disappear. Press the caps lock. So it's going to be with lowercase letters. And I'm going to make a ruler from left to right. Press control R. So this way it's going to show the rulers and just drag one ruler, some like this here and here. From here, we're going to convert the panther into shapes. So right click, create on, go to create and create shape from text. Okay, so we're going to type in here in the search path. As you can see here, it's going to show the path from the P, A, and T, E, and so on and so forth. But what we have to do is pull this right where it starts and click on these. I'm going to pull this here to one second. I'm going to expand the letter T. So I'm going to select here, just drag it to the right and now press and hold shift. So you isolate it to left or right. So it won't move that easily up and down. I'm going to make the rest of the letter shorter. So it's going to fit in. I'm going to release this. I'm going to pull this back. See, and now it basically animates. I'm going to select all the diamonds. Actually, I'm going to go from the bottom to up and right click, go to keyframe assist and click on easy ease. So this is basically the animation is going to be smoother with this. Okay. Uh, I'm going to select the first diamonds here. Press Ctrl C, place this here and press Ctrl V. So as you can see, uh, I just gonna move this a little further. There you go. So as you can see, uh, it starts and now it goes back, but uh, I don't want that. So I gonna reanimate this. So I'm gonna pull this here and animate another letter. I can animate the E this time. And do the same thing. I'm just going to copy paste this again. Control C. Uh, we're going to place this right here. Control V. And voila, this is kind of it. Uh, yeah, it looks pretty good. So you can play around, test it out and uh, do a lot of magic. It's a lot of fun, to be honest. I can experiment more with this. So yeah, thanks for watching. And uh, if you're new on the channel, don't forget to subscribe and hit the notification bell so you can know the file with updates and also check out the other videos. Have a great day. Bye bye.